These iconic Caribbean sea snails are extremely important to the Bahamas, but they could go extinct within the next 10 years. Studies show the conch population in the Bahamas is dropping significantly. Conchs are sea snails with hard pink and orange shells. Their meat is considered a Bahamian delicacy, often steamed, deep fried, or served raw with citrus juices and fresh vegetables. But overfishing in the Caribbean puts conch populations at risk, and potentially 9,000 Bahamian fishers out of work. That's about 2% of the country's small population. In 2015, more than 400,000 pounds of conch were exported from the Bahamas, worth roughly $2.3 million. Conchs require specific conditions to reproduce. They can only mate when 50 or more snails in a group are releasing eggs at once. And because of overfishing, conchs are struggling to gather in large enough numbers needed for mating. This means the hard-shell sea animals may eventually die of old age before ever reproducing. Scientists encourage divers who fish for conchs to leave the snails inside their shells. That way, fishers can determine if the conch is old enough to be legally removed from the ocean by looking at how thick the shell's flared lip is. The thicker the shell's flared lip, the older the conch. Conchs were a largely populated species in the Florida Keys until overfishing and commercial harvesting caused its fishery to collapse in 1975. Haiti and Aruba also have been subject to conch overfishing. So scientists have made recommendations to better protect the sea snails. They suggest establishing a size limit for legally harvesting conch based on a shell lip thickness of 15 millimeters, ensuring the snails are mature enough. They also recommend ending conch exports from the Bahamas. Should the Caribbean's fishermen refuse these changes, the study suggests it may be necessary to close the conch fishery for at least five years.